Yo, why you so fly? My daughter is you. <laughs> What's going on? Hi. Got the fresh boots. Got the hollow shirt. Let me see that. Okay. Hollow. All right. No, but I'm not gonna throw the peace on. That's lame. Cardi B. She from the Bronx. Cardi B is from wherever I said she from. <laughs> Take a number. I was lightning before the thunder. Thunder. She from Harlem. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. As a matter of fact, I'm from the Bronx. Says when? Says where my birth certificate. Oh. Oh. You was just born there. No, I lived there till I was five. Oh. You're a hater. You don't know. That don't even technically count. You're a hater, Kara. <laughs> okay, my oldest brother, my asshole brother, and my sister was literally. Grew up there. You don't know nothing about Arthur Ave. You don't know nothing about Tremont. You don't know nothing about 3rd Avenue. Come on, come on. Don't that don't mean nothing just because you spent five years that you don't even remember in the Bronx. I remember my block, my building. Yeah. Whatever. Let me come up into this bougie ass town where all you hear is creepy. Hello, hello. Hello. Grasshoppers and lightning bugs. That's good. Crime is so high, them niggas don't even come out no more in the summertime. <laughs> we first came here, we was like, oh my God, what is that? I'm from the Bronx. By <laughs> yourself. You want to be from the Bronx. Cardi! Right. I'm about to make some money because I'm like, Cardi B game. Gaudy, body, gaudy, body. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to make this shmoney. <laughs> I'm about to be a Cardi B dancer. Oh gosh, I cannot. We put one of them little sweatshirts on one of my kids. Get a million dollar offer to be a Sean John model. But why is he still gonna offer the kid the money if the mother That's was the mother okay was with it? Like, yeah. But I don't know, cause she had to be translated. She's British. She don't know shit. Clearly. Clearly. All right, you need to learn how to not park so close. This is the thin line between racism and they're trying to get abolished. You calling down yet? Yeah, I'll be there in a little bit, so I'll see if she wants to eat it. All right. Woo! Man, I was supposed to start the vlog upstairs, supposed to have my smoothie, but I couldn't because the blender wouldn't open. I blame my mom for that. But it's okay because I just ate a whole big bowl of fruit. You now I gotta get that body right. Gonna be working out. Can't be eating trash even though I had pizza yesterday when I got home. Open my eyes for me next shortly, mommy. Okay. That's why I don't I don't agree, I don't agree with them having that meeting in that room. I'm see you guys all those people house. and all that just that's too much excitement for her. Fresh out, ain't nothing to go back. 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 Did I hang up? Yeah, I did. Woo! Litty titties. Mm. Yeah, man. Look real Rastafari. Out for another day. Got my little poncho on, sweatpants, tied Uggs, comfy baby, comfy weather. You know what I'm saying? Doe asked me to come over last night, but I was tired from the gym, so I didn't. I haven't hung out with Alina. I'm supposed to be seeing her today too. Who knows? Who knows? Nobody knows the trouble I see. Yo, make sure y'all go watch the video I just posted for the H&M fiasco. You know what I'm saying? It should be up now, if I'm not mistaken. Make sure you guys go follow me on Twitter so you can see the video first. Always on Twitter, baby. Follow me. There you go. 
Oh, I thought Dell was gonna come to the door. Oh, he was taking a shit. This nigga sent me by the time I get here, he will be done with his shitty, shitty ass nigga. All this is fucking gay as hell. I like it so much. <laughs> Not a toothbrush. <laughs> the bro is this. This is so fucking dope. Got y'all teeth and eyes looking real white. Okay. Like that. Oh, I like that. So I'm at Doe's house right now. And we watching, uh, what's this? Flora Bama. Flora Bama Shore. So I got a question. Oh, you over there doing stuff that you shouldn't be doing. What's going on? Um, would you go on reality TV? Yeah. Like a show like that? Be isolated in a house with seven different strangers, mm -hmm. no cell phone, no human contact. For the TV. Can't take the important niggas like the ones that know they gonna be saying, "Yo, don't told me these niggas was in here fucking and sucking." Nick, I'm about to tweet this. Yeah, cause you, you can't text me. Tell me no juicy shit. I, I don't know. It depends on the show. I wouldn't do no love show. Like I probably do. What was that? When they did the obstacle course and stuff like that? I do one of those. Well, this ain't really a love show. This is just them kissing. Yeah, this is like yeah, the, like the Jersey show of like the South, basically. Are you showing that? Show like that? No. I don't want to be the only black girl though. I would have to have another black person in there with me because I think I would lose my mind. Oh man, most of the time it's 15%. I would lose. Mama. Mama. No, they don't. They, they, it's usually sometimes one. It just so happened on this show, there's two. Like, I don't know if you've ever seen this. It's on MTV. I might do a little series where I talk about shows and shit like that. Let me know if y'all want me to do some shit like that. that I'm talking about, the crazy, unnecessary shenanigans. But yo, if you haven't seen my new video, make sure you go watch that video, man. It is the, basically, the H&M video. So, go show love to that for me, please. I love you forever. You think black people are too sensitive? I think black people are too sensitive. Black people just want a reason to be mad at white people. Like, we know white people are racist. It's a, it's a parent fact. But y'all keep giving them more money. I don't get it. Y'all ain't opening your own businesses, but you're mad at white people for selling y'all shit with shit on it. Like, come on. Okay. But that's how you feel? That's so you'll be the parent that'll allow your kid to wear the coolest monkey in the jungle sweater? No. Oh. I never said I let my kid wear the coolest monkey in the jungle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just making sure I Hello? still got you here because you, you like to switch it up on us from time to time. Yeah, All right, so you know it's Wednesday. It's time for the podcast recap. Stop trying to be over my vlog. Yeah, I know y'all like this face. Where you go? Oh, she's hiding. Nobody loves your face. Look at those curly ones. You dumb ugly. Never. <laughs> I had never had an ugly day in my life. Yesterday. Never. Yesterday was your ugly day. Never had an ugly day in my life. I thought about it one time. I was like, maybe. I... Nah, I was like, nah, nah. Right now, don't you look ugly? Ah, look at the top of his head. <laughs> look at his lips. <laughs> Spade. Never. Popped. Finished. Beautiful. <laughs> yes. Love yourself. I make my mama proud. Free yourself. See, like, oh, my son is handsome. I'll be like, thank you. You know your mama got to tell you that, right? I know, she doesn't. My mama told me. She told me, she said, if you was ugly, I would have told you. 
But she said you very handsome, son. I, I like, don't think you're ugly. You don't think I'm ugly? I don't think you're ugly. <laughs> you're very ugly. That's a face, that's a face only about the kid love, bro. <laughs> We're gonna ignore the fact that Sean was just picking his nose just a few minutes ago. <laughs> well, I, I can do such things. Nigga, ugly. You cute. I wouldn't date you though. Yeah, yeah, I got some good leaves. I got one. Only because I like light skins. Are you passing? If if your kid came out looking at like me, you'd be happy. That's no, it happened. just so happened that we probably had sex, Jordan. Okay. And we had a baby. No, I'm yeah. saying if your kid looked just like me, you would be happy because I'm a good looking man. That's why. Or well, if you had a brother that looked like me, you'd be proud to call me your brother because I'm good looking. You feel me? This is who I am. I'm a good looking individual. This is not being cocky. I'm confident. You feel me? If you don't feel the same way about yourself, then you ain't invested in yourself. You feel me? Can I preach to the choir one time? Yeah. Love. Love yourself. That's it. Period. That's where it starts. And then everything else. You can do all that other shit. Like loving other people and shit. But love yourself first. Yeah. You, know, you can do all the other shit. Just love yourself first. Yeah. <laughs> nice way to encourage the children. Everything else is just like an add-on. Like, if you love yourself, it's just going to lead to good shit, you know? It's positive energy. Thanks. Love, 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 love. Love is love. love Ever heard yourself. that old expression? Love is love. Love is love. Yeah. Love is love. What's love spelled? But backwards? what is love? Love is a if not love. Imagination. Okay, my nigga's preaching over here to the mm -hmm. choir. Y'all listening? Hit him one more time, Sean. Preach it. But what is love? If not pain. Mm. Mm. Talking about love. No, I hate talking about love. You got so. bit by the love bug. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Long time ago. Facts. Shit got you infected. Yeah. I'm poisoned for the rest of my life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's no vaccine for that shit. Facts. You know, I remember when love wasn't even like a worry. Like, that was nothing that I worried about. Like, you just like someone. And then it came a, a strong, like, and then when that strong life became like a like, 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 love, you just like, what the fuck? Your first heartbreak, man. Oh, that shit wasn't that nice. Was, bad. was yours good, nigga? <laughs> the fuck? You, your heart was broke. You ain't gonna tell me that shit experience. That shit like this. If I, if I may quote Shania Twain, the first cut is the deepest. <laughs> This cheesy ass nigga. This nigga read too much. Books. Yeah, he read too much. He's too smart. <laughs> I don't even know who Shania Twain is. Yeah, I'm sitting here like, yeah, Shania, huh? Yeah, I know a girl named Shania, though. Shout out second. Shania. Because we went to high school or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> How trash it is. First heartbreak sucked. Second heartbreak was like, why the fuck did I even do this again? And why did it feel, why does it feel worse this time? Because I really, you really didn't love that person. That was like the, the, the pre-prepare for disaster. <laughs> then the, you know, the second, third time. How many heartbreaks you think you can handle in your life? I'm on my last one. I got one left. I got one left. You got one heartbreak. I'm left. trying to find my wife at this point because I can't keep dealing with this bullshit. I got one left. My heart is like hanging it's from a band-aid. Yeah, it's like dangling from so the band-aid. after band that, you're just going to be numb? You're going to like fuck love? Yeah, I'm going to be on some savage shit. <laughs> oh, D, I was just start clapping these bitches. <laughs> Literally. Running <laughs> around. <laughs> Big booty. <laughs> Big titties. <laughs> like, everybody's going down. You see those lips? AK-47. <laughs> I'm bringing the Tonka trunk and everything. Running over the all the tonka light skins. Trunk. What you know about the Tonka trunk? Oh, dude, you gotta bring in the heavy like artillery for the light trunk. skins, you know what I'm saying? Because they come, like, in a pack. Oh, you like yellow people. I love yellows. Oh, you a yellow. I love chocolates, too, but you I just like got a thing for, like... You like yellow starburst? No. You don't like yellow starburst? No, but I like... you like yellow people. Yeah. I'm Not so yellow, like... I like caramels. Caramel. 
Why are you correcting me? You gonna correct me if I say ketchup instead of the other way they say ketchup? Ketchup? What other way do you say ketchup? ketchup. I don't know. <laughs> the, the weird way. And then you that's got tomato, so, that's tomato. The way. They can say ketchup. Don't try to correct me, yo. Who says tomato? <laughs> it's Caucasian. <laughs> the fuck? Let me get some tomato. <laughs> Can I get some tomato in my salad? That sounds about right. Well, about right. Nigga, I want some tomatoes, nigga. Slice some shits up. You ready? Damn. Or your bacon, egg, and cheese, bitch. Never. That's tomatoes or your bacon, egg, and cheese? Yeah. You different. I don't dude. even eat eggs. You don't eat eggs? No. So why somebody get a lettuce? So what do you eat on, on your bacon, bacon, egg, and cheese? Uh, it's probably no, I eat bacon Brazilian. and cheese. I'm it was a Brazilian. How'd you know? Cause they would do some nasty shit like that. Why the fuck would you put lettuce and tomato on your bacon? Only thing that should go on a bacon, egg, and cheese is salt, pepper, ketchup. It's a fact. And remove the egg. Never. So you're going to have bacon and cheese mm-hmm. with salt, pepper, ketchup? That's disgusting. How? You're just missing one ingredient. You would eat it the that same way. basically a grilled cheese with bacon. That's why. So? Basic. I'm not basic. You know, sometimes you don't Are need to be eating to chicken. Egg? No, you don't need to be eating chicken sperm. <laughs> is that how you look at it? It's chicken sperm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so you rather eat the whole animal than the shit that ejaculates? Yeah. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> Yo, let me let me go eat this cat and this donut. <laughs> <laughs> that's how crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I rather eat the whole chicken. That's dude. like me saying I'm not. I'm not eating this popsicle right now. You crazy? So you right. So you rather eat? You rather cook sperm instead of eat a human? First of all, I don't eat sperm. <laughs> <laughs> On the record, I do not eat sperm. I don't know what she's talking about. Would you rather eat sperm? No, I don't eat sperm. <laughs> You trying to catch me? No, no I'm just saying because we're talking about chicken sperm because that's basically what eggs. It's an egg. Uh-huh. Chickens lay eggs. So you rather eat a woman's ovaries than the, the woman? What? So you eat an ass? You eat a woman's ass or you eat an ovaries? Woman's ass or ovaries? Yeah. Woman's ass. <laughs> Who the fuck eats ovaries? Or the placenta. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Now, I might eat the placenta. No, I heard okay. that shit is really good for you. And you feed it to your kid, too, they, I think. Where'd you eat mine? <laughs> no, I'm not eating your placenta. That's weird, buzz. Like, yeah. Fucking Kim Kardashian bullshit is that? Like, nah, I'll no, eat is, placenta. it's really good for no, you. No, I'm not saying that. research. All right, but there's a lot of things. It's good for a baby because it has stem cells. And it, what it does, it promotes growth. Nigga, you grow. <laughs> you a grown ass man trying to eat placenta. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Yo, Come hey, on, Jordan, baby. Let me eat. Yo, yo, Jordan, let me eat your placenta. Me yo, placenta. try to put some of that placenta on my plate. <laughs> With a side of cornbread. <laughs> I want to sap it up. Nah, <laughs> niggas do that. They you gonna fry it like niggas chicken? Eat you eat Nigga, no. You don't eat chillings? Fuck no. You eat chillings? That shit is nasty. That shit smell like shit. Like it is shit. pig intestines. That's where the shit is. Pig feet? No, nope. I don't eat nothing else other than bacon, ham, and chicken. Chicken strips, chicken breast, chicken thigh. I've eaten oh, you pigs. Eat no, you don't eat chicken gizzards? Who the fuck? Why? Why am I, I eating the gizzards? Good. Why? Good gizzards is good. Hold I eat chicken gizzards. Eat no, chicken gizzards is good. No, I'm not doing that. You eat ham hocks? No, I'll just eat. Nah, because there comes slice. a point where I see there comes a point when you're when you're just being. See, the thing is, like American and the Western world is like niggas is wasteful as fuck. You go to niggas is wasteful as fuck. They wasteful. eat the whole animal. Yeah, you go to any other country, they eat. They eat everything. Yeah, they down be to eating the balls. You eating chicken balls? Nah, like, would you? Nigga, I eat chicken balls before. I eat rooster balls. Uh, yeah, that's, rooster balls that's the teriyaki sauce. It's an Afro beef. If you throw some teriyaki sauce on that chicken Put some barbecue sauce on that chicken. Put some barbecue sauce on my... Nah, I'm like, I'm gonna make that into a sauce. Oh, chicken balls. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is like chicken nuggets, I guess. Oh, nah. <laughs> <laughs> See what you're trying to do right there, but no. <laughs> chicken nuggets is just chicken, nigga. It tastes like chicken gizzards. What, the balls? Yeah. See, what gets me tired is like, why don't the it's whole like the chicken taste the same? 
Because it's a different part of the body. It's not a muscle, though. You feel me? That's why. Your foot probably tastes different than your head. I mean, because I walk on these shits. Exactly. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they season. <laughs> they got extra spice. <laughs> <laughs> they pepper. <laughs> Uh, Ooh, how your ass tastes. <laughs> you nasty. Extra spicy. Extra spicy. Imagine cooking human ass. Nah, I can't imagine. I probably smell like butt. Oh, D, like a fresh shit, a fresh hot I shit. I probably smell good when I'm cooked. I just feel Nigga, like you I probably would, taste, taste like taste oh, gee, spoiled I, milk. I'm like a slow roasted smoked Indian ham. You would be an Indian ham hock. Jordan. I'm like a jaguar roasted. I'm a roasted jaguar. I was gonna say a rooster. A rooster? <laughs> a roasted rooster. No, I ain't no fucking Or maybe rooster, some fried chicken. Or maybe like a, a Put your arm like this. Fried chicken. Chicken wing. Look. The Jordan wing. This is a full chicken right here. Oh, chicken right here. This is out of control. Oh my god, I got 12 minutes of vlog footage. Man, nigga, you know I would taste good if I was cooked. Because I told the people that those cannibal niggas when they was out here. Yo, no, not for nothing. Like, not for nothing. Sell y'all a finger for, for a million. If you were a cannibal and if you were a zombie, what part of the body would you go for? Copy the head first. The fingers. The fingers. I'm eating fingers. I don't like people's dirty fingernails, so I'm probably nah, not like, going to go for the fingers. I'm like going to roast them, obviously. It's like, killing on that. Like the back of the knee. The back of the knee? <laughs> what? Yours, what, what the fuck? What the so fuck? I'm trying to eat the back of somebody's like, knee. <laughs> out of all places, this is like, the back of the knee is probably the juiciest, huh? Because <laughs> it got all that extra fold right there, so it all accumulates. He's trying to have like a feast. I might do a back of a thigh. Or or, thigh. or or someone's thumb, like right here. I don't know why. This is like a jumpstick 3D. Yeah, you cut this shit off. Y'all niggas is talking crazy. This is a zombie apocalypse. If this is gonna happen, you're gonna start having to eat people. I'm just gonna go straight for the head. You eat somebody's head? Straight up. Like, I'm a monster. I'm gonna bring this guy. You still can think. <laughs> I'm gonna let you okay. live. Oh, we making niggas live? Oh, I thought we was eating to feed ourselves. Oh, we killing them? Hell yeah, nigga. I'm eating the uh, whole body. I don't kill people. Oh. I'm but not, it's... But I'm it's. with that. So how you gonna survive? You know, we're gonna be zombies that come to a point where we're gonna have a marketing and currency system set up. So we're just gonna buy human parts. Nigga said buy. Right, we're gonna let the other niggas kill them. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna be humans on farms. We're gonna kill them. Humans on farms. This is the things that we're talking that about in 2018. Uh, That's crazy. Became a, like, seven and then we're selling human beings. Oh, bro. No, G, we gotta do that. Oh, no, G, we gotta do that. I hate mm -hmm. you all. That would be a fire ass zombie movie. Imagine the zombies become a civilization, become smart. It's kind of a contradiction because they don't have like brains or whatever. But it would be dope. This is true. I don't know what that says. Who's this? All right, Naya. I think she knew. But shout out to Naya for being active. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter so you can get a shout out. Drop down some comments. I'm going to end the vlog here so we can start the podcast soon. I'll probably start the vlog after I end this, if that makes any sense. Make sure you come back tomorrow to see what's happened and what's not. Um, yeah, so that's it. Okay, bye. Say bye, Jordan. Bye, like guys. That. Get up with you, baby, right?